I'm Matt Thad, and this is Science Mom. We're here for challenge problem number 39. Is it more probability? No probability this time. All right, nuts. <laughs> you were getting those too easily now. The student has become up. the master. I don't know about that. <laughs> All right, for today's challenge, you have seven points that you need to arrange in the plane so that there are six rows of three. Ooh. Call them trees in this problem. Okay, six rows of three, and there's seven of them. Mm -hmm. And obviously my rows don't need to be parallel, and multiple trees can be in different rows. Th that's right. Or, yeah, same tree can be in different rows. Interesting. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right, I'm giving you three minutes for this problem. If you would like to do this yourself, or if you're a teacher and you'd like to give it to your class, there's a link in the description. You can log in and move them around and give it a try yourself. All right, science mom, your time begins now. Okay. Um, so, here is a row of three, and I want to make six, which seems like a ridiculously high number. But yeah, we've got to have three in a line and then if I do this I get two lines if I do this there's a third one two three four five so that's how I could make five rows and I need to make a sixth yes dang um Oh man. Okay. Think outside the box. Think outside the box. This is this is really tricky. Um Hmm. One, two, three, four, man, okay, um, I think maybe I should just try and, okay, so six, Six sided shape. Would be a hexagon. One, two, three, four, five, six. What you were doing six. was pretty clever. Yeah. Um, so if I have a hexagon and I put this one right in the middle, there's one, two, three. If I slide this one in, there's four, five. But then that, yeah, I'm just gonna back. Ooh, okay, one, two, like we go for like kind of spaceship -y design, one, two, three, and then I, four, five, okay, I need another, no, another that. color. That, that's it? Yeah, one, well, it's a little tiny bit sloppy. Right, so let's pick a new tool. Oh, that's cool, okay. How do I? So, so now you're making a line. So yep. One, two, three, four, five. Six. There yeah. we go. Well yeah, done. That was tricky. Yeah. I, I like it though. Yeah, very nice solution. I, you did the hexagon and then you just collapsed the alternating corners down and it worked out nicely. Yeah. So, well done, Science Mom. Cool little shape. <laughs>